Okay, so everything I'm sharing in this episode is based on my personal experiments and my hands-on testing uh, these different apps. So as someone actively studying and researching AI apps like AGI, ASI related technologies, my goal is to really just gain real world experience with these tools. And today I'll be showcasing another like very interesting platform that I've explored, which is Tencent's Hunyun. Uh, sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong. So their website offers a, like almost a production level uh, module, which has all these different tools that do different things. So including 3D mesh generation, topology refinement for production readiness. I mean, like in production, this is not like to be cleaned up. This is ready geometry with textures that you can utilize. And I'm going to show you these examples now in Blender and Unreal. Uh, so texture creation from a single image or multiple images. And I've tried these and multiple images seem to work better. Uh, the 3D animation part, then they have something called SketchUp style modeling. And then a mini game where you can kind of create yourself as a game character. Relates to the gamers, like people may want to try to do that. That's that's very interesting. So while I haven't tried like every feature, I, I just saw this and I wanted to make a video. Uh, in this case, I am primarily focused on mesh and texture generation. So I really wanted to test the results in Blender and then in Unreal Engine to see like, could this be utilized in production? Are these really production ready? And my answer is yes. And if you continue watching, it's a long video, but I really think that this, this is probably the best uh, mesh generation that I've seen so far. I also was showcasing two other apps, so make sure to check those out. So you basically have a very simple interface that allows you to even change the lighting. And once you're in here, you, you can basically have two lights. And here I've used the single image and the output is uh, fairly impressive. Uh, and you can still go in and actually uh, create a even better topology with this and then create the textures. And these are all sort of individual tasks that obviously are sent out there once you you can't really do both together but you just click and it starts going off and creating the textures for you so they uh they're actually saved as individual files so if you were to uh want to create a even better topology you can do that you can just go in and basically select and create um different or less uh, type of um uh, approach on how you want to utilize the topology in your project, whether it's a game or I really think um, AR, XR, VR could definitely benefit from this. I mean, this could be for educational purposes too. My video isn't really just to say, hey, look, I mean, this is going to replace everything. I don't think it will, but it will eventually be a part of production. but we are the creatives. So that's all I'm really doing here. I'm just looking at what's happening, how far are these things are going. So here I've used multiple images on this one. Uh, very simple front, back and, and side view. Uh, it gave uh, a pretty good uh, model mesh. Uh, the textures are not bad. You're going to see that at the end of the video, or you can skip now if you want to see the unreal scene, uh, which is really impressive. I've also brought it into Blender. It can definitely tell a story. You can use this in your pre-production 
or if you're a toy company you can instantly uh, get the work from your artists and you can just create your toy designs and you'll have them like you'll print them out and if you look at the geometry here I mean this mesh is very clean so I can bring this to the Z mesher uh, you know I can bring it into Maya I can do it all quads uh, this is really impressive and, and I'm looking at more of the stylized work looks really promising obviously uh, here uh, it's really impressive like how much detail there is really because usually you get funky fingers or it's not really following something but the fact that this is coming from multiple images uh, so it means that this this is a very advanced technology here that we're looking at Uh, because, you know, the, these will basically serve almost as completed, uh, in my opinion. I mean, if I, again, this video is really not related to any production. Um, I just want to share my thoughts, my experience. And, you know, these things take time. I'm investing my weekends because I really want to know what's going out, like, into the uh, uh, creative field, what kind of apps are being developed. And this is also, uh, you know something that you can work with like you would in Comfy UI. This is like going to evolve into different modules and departments and each one eventually is also going to have agentics just like we're seeing it now with SaaS products or a lot of businesses. So again, this is just my personal opinion. Uh, none of this is for any production. I just choose to study these things and to let you know if you have any thoughts, feel free to comment. Uh, but always have your own judgment, you know, just go try them out yourself. Uh, it doesn't take a lot of time. It, it was a very easy sign up. Uh, very impressive what this company is doing. Um, and I think this, this will probably uh, be seen more and more. But again, I'll include the links and you guys can try this and see if this is something you would be interested in seeing for yourself.